So first year of MIST, my team was just a ragtag group of a bunch of random kids from multiple different schools who didn't even know each other. Um, I mean, I remember getting together the team. I just had to beg every single Muslim boy in my high school to join. I was like, there's a basketball game. I remember also putting together like the meetings for after MSA. All right. Like yeah. kind of like forcing people to come. I joined MIST in 2017 because one of my teachers brought it up. To be honest, at first we were looking for extracurricular activities. One of the chairs right now came up to me and he's like, Fraz, you should do MIST. I'm like, oh, uh, what is that? And then lo and behold, I'm in my junior year of high school going to this MIST tournament, which I had no idea what it was. And it turns out literally one of the only people I know there is him. I mean, yeah, like back then I was just like super like shy and awkward and I never really put myself out there or like stepped out of my comfort zone. We came, found hype and to me that was one of the funnest things ever. Every year we try to go like bigger and bigger. Like, just like a bunch of like just South Brunswick kids just like screaming so loudly, just like r and Mystery man. I think that first year we hung out with him a lot. We did really wacky things with him. So he actually made it a little extra fun that year. That was when I could say we first officially really became friends. And now five years later, I have spent an ungodly amount of time with this person. So one of the speakers there um, talked about uh, like your mental health. He really gave me a new perspective on how to handle mental health. It's kind of like me getting out of my comfort zone, I think. Like I'm now like MSA president and I have like a lot more like people that I have to look out for and I think it really helped me become more of a leader. I got to make the recap video for year three and it was the first time somebody had given me a chance to you know try video editing for somebody that wasn't just for my own personal use. So now I get to direct videos from MIST all the time which is so exciting. You have the ability to, to have Islamic speakers motivate them and show them what paradigm they're supposed to be living life with. I feel like that was something really powerful that I could give back to the community with. It ended up being like one of those experiences that like was kind of like life changing in a way. I went from like not really like doing things I didn't want to do and now I just like do things, you know. This guy especially is now the associate director of Miss New Jersey. And you know, Miss has become a huge part of our lives. I've gotten to do so many different things that have scared me and have been exciting and new and challenging. I finally like found like a community which I really, really enjoyed being part of. So that's why I continue doing this because um, it was us all being together as Muslims, you know, here for one reason, to please Allah. And I can say through Mist is one of the ways I found my best friends for life. Uh, why, am I, why am I getting emotional? <laughs>